Hi everyone, <clears throat> today I'm going to um, um, oh, by the way, uh, to my channel. Today I'm going to do my uh, um, one of my first pours. Of course, I did uh, practice a little bit, but still haven't managed to uh, get the right uh, recipe. I thought maybe I let you share my process. So. Um, I'm starting with uh, white and I'm using, um, this time I'm using a white gesso. Let me see. Looks like it's clucked. like that and the other one will be transparent upon uh, a neon green from Americana I do have a small canvas so I'm not uh, preparing a whole lot of paint but maybe I can do two I have from Americana Aqua Sky I would love to add a metallic one, a teal one from Americana too, just a little bit, not too much. And maybe, hmm, I think I will add a darker uh, blue too, this is a Wedgwood blue from Americana. like that then I will add in the right only in the right I'm adding some glue I do it all just by uh, feeling like that I will be adding um, a little bit of varnish in the other ones Now I'm stir. I'm going to stir. This really needs to. Um, I stir very well, so this could take some time. And I think I'm. We'll uh, fast forward this this part of the video. Hello everyone. I thought I would do a small voiceover because I wanted to apologize for uh, this kind of view you have. There are some black. Um, sites uh, on uh, next to my video and that's because I've um, filmed for the first time with my telephone I never did uh, do that before I always use my um, HD camera and now I thought okay maybe I should uh, test it out with my telephone and I did film it in the portrait mode and not uh, on the landscape mode so that's why the video is a little bit um, different than you are used for me I hope you still like it. This is just a test what I'm doing. Uh, nothing. Uh, I'm by no means. Uh, I am a professional at pouring uh, acrylic pouring. Just me playing and um, learning. And I thought maybe we can learn together. So let me know if you like the video. Then I will make more of them because I'm practicing. Uh, I'm planning practicing more uh, pouring, uh, acrylic pourings and trying out the different recipes and yes I already told in the video I will give credits to Anne-Marie I watch her uh, channel a lot thank you uh, Anne-Marie if you are watching and of course my very dear friend Muriel she does a lot of research on um, uh, different recipes I will link both uh, channels below so you can uh, check the uh, the channels of these girls too and um, yeah well that's it 
I see you in the next video. And please uh, let me know if you want me uh, to film more of these videos than, uh, of course, I do next time. My HD video camera. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye, girls. I will be adding, um, I'm using my friend Muriel, um, she found out that there is some dimethicone in this uh, Alviva Extraordinary Oil. So I will be adding on all of them with the little, uh, with the little ones, only one pump, or how should I put this, one, and in the right I have three and a drop. Give it a good stir. It has dimethicone in it, so it should uh, work. Oops. I did practice only two times before I, um, before this time, so it is really a practice for me. And I don't have a torch, so I hope I will get cells anyway. I've decided to, um, oh, I'm sorry, I do have some silicone. I will add some silicone to it. Oops. That wasn't a good plan. I will uh, add something in a small bottle after the video. <laughs> okay. Look at that. Love, love, love this. I'm going to um, put it on my canvas. Give it all a good stir. This one too. Okay. I'm going to do a uh, dirty pour. And I took myself, let me see, I just want this side to be open. A box, a cardboard box, like this. And I put this in here just to um, because there is going to be a lot of paint and as I told you this is practice for me right a little bit of my uh, metallic blue a little bit of my dark blue and I'm pouring from up high because Anne-Marie says that does something. 
I hope I have enough paint. It does something in the cup, as you can see. So let's hope this works. All my products I used were from Deco Arts, Americana. I do have cells in the cup, so My, um, this is a transparent one, That's, that also seems to be important. Some white. And I do want to save a little bit of my paint for, uh, to paint my sides, if the pool was I think I think I I have way too many paints but that's okay. I'm going to set them aside my paint. And now I'm going to wait for just a couple of seconds because I want uh, all the paint to come down. And I hope this works. I hope this works. I do have my heat gun. Um, I just want to test it. I saw my friend Muriel did it. So I just want to test it. If you haven't checked out her uh, channel, I will link it below. She does uh, magical stuff with uh, the pouring uh, thing. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I do have cells. I do have cells. I like it. Look the cup. I just don't want to mess too much with it. Let me see. I really want to leave it alone, but Maybe a little bit of swiping, like that. I hope you can see this. Let me put it a little bit up close. I really like it a lot. The only thing I really, uh, I, I, I find it so ashamed that there is so much paper, um, so much paint here, but 
there was not much I can do. Maybe I do have some. I will do that in a minute. That. I do have small white cough, so maybe I can put them in there. Like that. Maybe I can add something to. Just to cover my canvas. I'm sorry for being quiet for being quiet. <laughs> I'm very concentrated at the moment. I do love, love, love these colors. I normally don't use these colors, the black green ones, but I really like it a lot. I'm going to cover my sides. I forgot my gloves, but that's okay. I'm going to take some of my cups. I wasn't prepared good enough, girls. Let me see. Like this. Just for a moment so I can clean up my hands. I think I need two, one, two more. So I can add them before I do that. Ah, don't like that. Don't like that, leave it in there. I will do it like this. I really have a lot of cells. Really a lot of cells. No torching. I will be uh, doing with my heat gun. That really doesn't, does not do anything. It really does not do anything with the heat gun. Just want to make those cells a little bit bigger there. Okay. That's it, ladies. I really like it. I like it a lot. I've only used Americana paints. Let's see. I really need to clean up some of the edges here. I do want to get myself a, um, a torch. Still haven't done that. So, this is the results of my testing. Let me know if you would like me to make uh, more of these videos. And um, as I told you, I want to give all credits um, from everything I learned from Anne-Marie and from Muriel. So, now I want to make it my own. And maybe do faces on them. What do you think? I think a face on this would look amazing. Okay, girl, girls. See you. Bye-bye.